Hey, hey, Marky Mark here. I just wanted to make a quick video uh, just kind of explaining, give a quick run through of the Ether Delta platform and actually how to purchase on the platform or, or on the exchange. And I'm going to use an example of the Populous uh, project or token and with the ticker symbol of PPT. So really the first thing that you are going to need to do or how I did it and how I do it is uh, before you go onto Ether Delta, you're going to need to install the MetaMask Chrome plugin, which is ran through the Google Chrome browser. So you're going to need to use Google Chrome browser, go to the MetaMask plugin, click on that, and uh, get Chrome plugin. So what MetaMask does is allows you to run Ethereum dApps or a decentralized apps right in your browser without running a full Ethereum node. So go to that link and then this has added to Chrome yours. If you don't have it, we'll say add to Chrome. You'll click on that and you'll follow the prompts to set up your password and uh, set up your wallet. So what you'll do with that wallet is used for is to transfer your Ether or Ethereum from your My Ether wallet or any other wallet that you use. You're gonna transfer that into the MetaMask wallet. So once you have that, once you go through the uh, the install stage and, uh, and prompts and instructions, you'll know you did it whenever you see this little fox at the top right hand corner of your Chrome browser. So whenever you see that, then you know you can go to the Ether Delta, which I'll post this link in the comment section below where you can access that. So this is the Ether Delta platform give it one minute to load and so just kind of do a quick run through of, uh, of kind of how it's set up so on the right side these are all the past recently passed trades starting from the top and going down you can kind of see what the prices a certain symbol has gone at which we are on PPT right now the populous project you can see what they have the past prices they have gone at in ether so all the way down to the bottom, which is probably just in the last six hours is 0 0.0339. And then it goes up, up and down, up and down. And so anyway, this is just a little uh, little chart to kind of see what the movement has been. And then here's the order book. These are the buy and the asks, or the, the uh, bid and the asks that are being placed in the order book right now. So there's a, a bid price at 0 0.03015 and then there's an ask at a 0 0.03194 so those are battling it out to see who's going to get the top spot and um, uh, other than that you can go over here to the left and this is the, uh, the daily volume and the bid and the offer on uh, other various tokens and uh, symbols as well so going from there, well, the first thing that you want to do is transfer Ether into your MetaMask wallet. So whenever you first open it up, yours up, you're not going to have it. It'll be zero. So I have a little bit in here just for demonstration purposes. So what you're going to do is send Ether to this wallet. So whatever wallet you use or store your Ether in, which I have Coinbase pulled up right here, you're going to send that to your to your MetaMask address. So go up here in MetaMask, click on this icon, hover over it where it says copy, click on that. That's going to copy your address. So you want to send your Ether to that address. You're going to go in here to your wallet. That's the that's the MetaMask address, and you're going to put in however much Ether you want to send. So if you want to send 20 Ether. And you put in 20 and then send funds and then that is usually received pretty fairly quickly so once you send that and get a confirmation you'll then receive your ether in this wallet and so make sure you're on the ethereum main net or ethereum network so once you receive that from your ethereum wallet this metamask wallet is it will be automatically linked up to your ether delta so right here it has I have 1.408 ether. So that is linked up. So 
up here on the top left, this is kind of what you need to pay attention to. This is where it gets a little tricky. So make sure you are in the right symbol that you're looking to purchase. So uh, just and to give a little background on what Ether Delta is, I know a lot of people have some misconception and they uh, uh, it, it's not really user friendly and but it doesn't really need to be because that's not what it is there for because Ether Delta is a smart contract that helps or that allows you really to make peer-to-peer -peer decentralized exchanges with others. So what Ether Delta is good for is, uh, you know, instead of waiting and in the case that many of these new projects that are coming out uh, will get listed someday, uh, many times they get listed on Ether Delta before any of the other larger exchanges like Poloniex, Kraken, Vitrix, et cetera, et cetera. So in many cases, a lot of these new projects coming out will get listed on this exchange way ahead of those others. So this exchange is not as liquid. Uh, there's not as much trading done, but there can be some good potential for some nice profits if, if you expect a certain project to, inc to increase in value in the future. So you can get in earlier than, you know, for say the masses of the other traders that are trying to get in. So make sure you're on PPT, PPT per F if you're looking to purchase Populous, which is what we're going to be doing. So I'm in PPT per F and your wallet, this is what you need to pay attention to. Your wallet right here is what is in your MetaMask wallet. So I have 1.408 in my MetaMath, MetaMask wallet of in Ether. So before you do anything, you'll need to transfer or deposit, I'm sorry, you'll need to deposit that Ether into your Ether Delta. So for example, I'm gonna, tran I'm gonna deposit 0 0.03 Ether into Ether Delta. So that is what this is this number means right here. So whenever I deposit that, I should see 0.52 ether in my ether delta. If I'm gonna deposit, submit, and then shortly I should see that 0 0.03 be deposited into this ether delta. Now once your funds or your ether are in your ether delta, you are then able to purchase on Ether Delta Exchange. So now what I'm going to do is I want to purchase Populous. So I'm gonna come down here, you can make your own order or you can just click on one of these buyer asks up here. So just for demonstration, I'm gonna click on one of these. So that's amount to sell of PPT, amount to buy of PPT. So I'm just gonna buy one at a price of 0 0.02. If I just wanna hit the top of the asking price or the bid price right now, just to see if I can get to go through, I'm gonna go 0 0.02995 F per one PPT. Buy and then you'll sign the transaction and it has been sent to the order book. So shortly after, it'll either get filled or you'll see a highlighted section wherever your order stands will be highlighted and you can kind of see where you, are, you, where you are at in the order book. So let's see if it gets filled. If it gets filled, I should have two Ether Delta in here instead of one. So let's wait a couple moments and see if that, if that fills fairly quickly. So right now, just from a purchase earlier, I have one PPT in Ether Delta right now. So just, just say, for example, that order that I just put in got filled. That one would be transferred into Ether Delta right here. And then after you do that, you want to deposit or you want to withdraw. I'm sorry. You want to withdraw your PPT, your one PPT into your wallet. So you'll click on withdraw, the amount you want to withdraw, which is one. And then what that will do, whenever you click withdraw, 
that will withdraw it and put it into your wallet. So this is just a quick, this is just a rundown of the transaction and then the max transaction fee is 21 cents. Submit. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna reload this and see if that went through. So it ha so they haven't gone through yet. They usually take a couple moments. And but you can see my first initial deposit of F E I'm sorry, Ether into my Ether Delta came through. I have okay, there's my order. See, I said it was gonna be highlighted if it didn't get filled. So mine is the next order up. If 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 these cells or if these asks come down to this point. 02995 and hit that price then I'm gonna get filled and then once that gets filled then it will be deposited into the ether Delta right here so uh, but other than that, that that pretty much sums it up it's it's once you learn the platform is pretty straightforward but I know that you know people have been just going nuts and and losing money from this platform because they're not using it correctly or they're, or they're not paying attention to what they're doing. I know people have lost uh, twenty and thirty thousand dollars just because they entered numbers incorrectly, incorrectly, and weren't paying attention to what they're doing or they just didn't know how to use the platform. So uh, feel free to reach out and ask any questions if you have any. Uh, and just two, just to be safe, what I always do is if you're experimenting with with a new platform. Or, or a new uh, a new system start with small amounts so you can start with fractions of your full say if you want to purchase a uh, say for example uh, if you want to make a fifteen thousand or thirty thousand dollar purchase you know start with a small number of ether which will equate into you know a couple dollars or a dollar first just to see if the transaction goes through and if you're using the platform correctly. So but other than that, feel free to reach out if you have any questions. And uh, it, it is pretty counterintuitive on this platform because you have to do all these little things with these clicking. You have to get in, in your wallet, then you have to transfer it and deposit it into your Ether Delta, then you have to withdraw it. And then, but other than that, uh, should be it and you should be good to go.